All right, guys, Shotty T here. This is the fourth war of the season. Um, a little slight change up in my path this time. Um, they're banning Quake, Ghost, and Torch, um, which for my Quake plans, because I plan, I wanted to use Quake for some fights, but we have to make alternatives. So I had to do some communication to make sure I can bring the right team. So we're bringing Corvus. Captain America Infinity War with the Defiance tactic, which is going to be relevant for one of the fights, and Warlock, which is going to be relevant for one particular fight, and that was the, the key. So we're taking Path 4 to start, and then once we get to Section 2, we'll take Path 5 as usual. So we're going to take Corvus. We're going to try to build up some charges. We can hope we can get two charges out of this Stark fight. Uh, if not, we'll definitely get one, and then we can get another one with um, Deadly Origin because she's an Avenger. And then we can get our third at a minimum from Omega Red. We're going to use a Cosmic Boost for that fight. And then afterwards, we got um, Immortal Abomination. And again, I had to make sure this particular profile had willpower. And unfortunately, I can't. I couldn't duel him to find out because he has a robot as his first champ. So I asked one of my teammates to see if when they fought one of his defenders, they had willpower. They said yes. So as a result, I will be using Warlock to apply that infection and keep the power under control throughout that whole fight. And then we're going to take on Tigra with Cap, Doom with Cap, Cosmic Ghost Rider with Cap. Uh, someone is taking on Mr. Negative, and then by the time we get to Penny Parker, hopefully we can have four charges. We're just going to try to blitz her down because that's a pretty annoying placement for her. And the fact that Quake is banned makes it even more annoying because I would have used Quake for that fight. And as you guys can see, we have a Nimrod boss in which I timed out last time. The only bonus I've lost so far this season. So as a result, somebody else is taking that fight. Could I, use, could I take it with Corvus? I don't know, maybe, but I'm, I'm not gonna try. But I guess it might be possible, but that unstoppable armor might be an issue. But anyway, um, we're gonna jump right in and get started. Um, we're not gonna boost for this first fight because we really wanna try to, try to hit Starkey as much as possible to get him to evade. <laughs> so we don't wanna boost for this fight. So, this node is not that difficult to build up Fury, long distance relationship. So really, I can heal if I have to, if I get wrecked a little bit, but I shouldn't, I should be fine. Matter of fact, let's do a health boost. We'll do that, we'll do that. <laughs> Always to have insurance, we'll do 25% health boost. So that's pretty much the only boost I really need for this fight and may not really need it, but better safe than sorry. Right, so let's see if we can get that see if we can get lucky to get two charges in this fight okay perfect perfect Perfect. We got two charges in that first fight. Gonna ask for a better start there. Now for this next fight, we're gonna use a power start boost because I really want to just not worry about the SP1 and also that um, what's that thing, the um, bubble shield. So we're gonna use a power start boost here. Uh, Power start boost, and I guess I can go ahead and get my my attack boost started because I uh, I need to save them because I got a tough stretch and I'm gonna run out of energy before I get to that. So we'll get by. Matter of fact, let's matter of fact, let's do a temporary boost. Let's do one of these common boosts here. That'll be better. 
we'll use that one. We'll use that one and that one. Why not? Okay. <laughs> we should be more than prepared to blitz her down. I just don't want to take too long on this fight. I'm just going to knock her down first. Alright, then hopefully we can get her down. Overkill, complete overkill, but again, we got him. As I get deeper into these war fights, you probably won't see me boost as much because you guys see I'm handling like the key is just to not get hit. And that's uh, for the most part, I do a decent job of not getting hit, but you never want to take fights for granted either. But because obviously these boosts are indefinite. But anyway, that's part one. We're going to get to part two afterwards. Guys, um, I'm in the poker tournament right now. There's a break in the action. So didn't get a chance to record my uh, last fight. But I got four charges on Corvus now. I, that was a super quick fight against Omega Red. But now we're going to go to section two. We got five minutes until another energy. But I'll be able to get just enough we might wait around um, this so this fight here is going to be against um, the mortal abomination so one of my teammates gave me a heads up they said that this guy this profile has willpower but that's relevant because for warlock I can just parry him Carry heavy him to death pretty much and minimize him throwing specials and use that infection to drain and keep his power under control. So we still got our boost active and we'll use an invulnerability boost just in case. So yeah, so we'll do that. All right, so here we go. Warlock has done his job for the war. <laughs> That's the only fight I have for him. Well, actually, I did have another fight with him. But, um, alright, so now we got Tigra. Alright, we're gonna pretty much do. Uh, we don't need that. Up. 
please don't pop up again during this fight. Right, let's just turn Wi-Fi off real quick. I don't want no pickup of any connection. All right, so this one, we're gonna have to do a lot of repairing, but we're up to the task. Same to be. Okay, we got 17 seconds spare from our invulnerability boost. So we're good. Let's just get rid of that fight. Jesus. I did have someone get my attention while I was at this break. So that person almost cost me. I was gonna, I don't condone violence, but yeah. <laughs> he almost messed me up. I'll let him know when I get back to the poker table. Um, all right. Um, what am I do for this fight here? What to do with this fight? I don't know if this guy has missed this version or not. Let me see something here. Just gonna check something out real quick. Okay, he does have a Doom profile pick. Let's see something real quick. Yes, I have been dueling today. A duel is your friend. I'm just gonna check something real quick. Just wanna see what kind of Mr. Dispersion this guy has. Okay, got a little bit, got a little bit. It looks like it might be level three. Um, ooh, this fight's gonna be a little nervous here. Almost inclined to let my teammate take this fight now. <laughs> oh man. This fight ain't that difficult. Because I do have that defiance, so I don't have to worry about, yeah. What am I talking about? I don't have to worry about any debuffs or any uh, buffs expiring. That's right. That's why I did Defiance. Just so you guys know, immunity to buffs. So, so I don't have to worry about that.
get out of the corner. Computer's not playing with my intercept at all. There we go. Man, he finally played the intercept when it mattered. That should be a KO right there. There we go. Looks like the tournament is about to go back. Yeah, that was a near death scenario. And the invulnerability boost mattered. So, listen, make sure you use your boost. But anyway, guys, that's it for me tonight. So, part, the last part will be in the morning. All right, guys, uh, I guess we got one more fight before we go to bed because um, that way I can just wake up and just fight Penny instead of waiting. To see whenever mr negative is down so we'll go ahead and go in this fight um i think our boost expired so we're not gonna waste a six hour boost for one fight so we're just gonna do the common boost we'll do the 10 percent of each one 10 percent there 10 percent there and i guess the 15 percent there um and then we'll do the um class based Power boost we have actually let me check something real quick yeah I thought they were in the store might as well let's get two of those yeah let's get that out of the way okay so we're gonna try to get this fight out of the way as soon as possible um, might as well heal as well we got one of those and we'll do a power start boost so that we can get the two bars of power as soon as possible um actually i need to reach top up my invulnerability boost because i've been using those quite a bit this particular war all right so here we go
away. Oh boy, that fight was kind of annoying there. I did not expect that, guys. Honestly, did not expect that. Um, yeah. I honestly did not expect that. That's the first depth of the season. I didn't drop the shoes for this. Good God. I feel better about that Penny Parker fight at least. Oh my goodness. <laughs> well, we'll let that KO stew there. No point of reviving him. Well, guys, should have went to bed. <laughs> All right, let's see where we are in the BG. We got five deaths and they haven't died yet. So we got some machines over there, but we're up for the war. So we got a chance and this is pretty evenly matched 65 million versus 65, it's like 66 million. So it's an evenly matched war. So just our BG kind of behind, but I contributed to it. So I'm mad at myself for that one. So that sucked. Anyway, well, lesson learned for that particular fight. Let somebody else take that from now on. All right, bedtime. All right, guys, good morning. Actually, it's 10 15 now. I'm actually at work, had to quote unquote take a bathroom break so I can do this fight. Obviously, don't want to get in the habit of doing that because sooner or later they'll catch on. But um, sometimes when you actually have to go to the bathroom, you know, it's like a cry wolf situation. But as you can see, there it's 22 to 16, so we got a pretty solid lead and in the RBG. We only got three defender kills, so definitely gotta try to get some defense here. But yeah, that Corvus fight was ridiculous. Cleaning up for um, cleaning up for Cap, and I'm trying to figure out what boost I should use because I don't want the SB2 to be that overpowering. Um, <laughs> Cause I want to be to just have just enough power boost to be able to get just to an SP2 and not to another, um, not to an SP3, because I want to kill her as soon as possible. So for that reason, I'm gonna do the 150% power boost and then I'm gonna combine that with a uh, lesser attack boost. I mean, it's kind of hard to gauge his, I tried to watch some YouTube videos of some Corvus mission gameplay to see how much Power he gains back from his SP2. So I think this is probably the closest formula I can come up with. So we're gonna go with it. Uh, the fight shouldn't take long, but I'm just worried about gaining too much power. But let's see. the sweet spot that was it <laughs> yeah if I took 26 seconds bro y'all need to ban Corvus man he's dangerous he's dangerous he's crazy that was just 150 percent boost if it was 200 percent I think I would have got two bars of power but again I I don't want to, or if I would have did like a 20 percent boost so now I know the formula so I do a 20 percent attack boost uh, champion boost and that'll get me right there so yeah that felt pretty good there makes me want to even makes me want to take on this fight but somebody else is assigned to it i'm just gonna see how much health he has i mean 382,000. i can probably take him down but i'll let someone else take it um but 
I'm there in case I need it. But I think that should be my last war of the season. So stay tuned for the results. Got about less than four hours left in war. All right, later. All right, guys, we got the win. Probably our best uh, offensive war to date. Um, but again, it was an evenly matched war. So like I said, if it's evenly matched, we feel really good about our chances. We just have to start winning in tier three because uh, both of our wins have been in tier four and both of our losses have been in tier three because our rating is right around that threshold of tier three and tier four. So our attack bonus was 479. We had 16 deaths. They had 37. Wow, it was 27 when I last checked. Looks like they did not. Well, looks like they did finish our. Okay, looks like they didn't have a set of defenders either. So I guess that was in another BG. But yeah, um, yeah BG1, 160, BG2, 159. Would have been a 160 if it wasn't for me. I missed the bonus. I'm still mad at myself for that, but we'll fix it next time but yeah and uh yeah it looks like we're gonna be doing some uh, arena grinding this weekend because um there are some doubloons offers to get to help get to paragon a lot sooner than you think so yeah so be on the lookout for that i may still get some battlegrounds footage in this weekend but it probably won't be as much as i thought because i'm gonna be <laughs> Grinding Arena, but we'll be spending some family time today and tomorrow as well. So it's going to be in spurts. But anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed that video. Like, share, comment below, subscribe, and hit that bell notification.